Guys, Minister Nwike have come out to let us know the reasons why Nigerians, uh, Nigerian youth cannot protest. According to him, he said a whole lot of things. Let me just play the audio for you so that you hear what he said and after which you, tell, you let us know what you think about his opinion on the comment section. Listen to his voice. You know, there are politicians, they want to be in power at all costs. Who are these people who want to do protests? I'm trying to do on social media, they have applied to me to grant the people square. Do you apply to me through social media? You write a letter to the minister. I will see you. Who are you? What do you want to do? How many days do you want to spend? How much will you pay? <laughs> listen, listen, listen. It is not, you see, when people want to do propaganda in everything, I want them on channel news telling the IG I've, I've, I've applied. You don't apply to me through channels. You must apply properly. You must pay what the cost security cost. So if there's any damage for the facilities, we'll take that security cost and repair. You know, you don't just because you want to play to the gallery. We don't just give people just because you have applied. You for you for, you fulfill the conditions. There are people who have failed the election. The only way they think they can be relevant is to overthrow the government in two ways, whichever ways. I find the youth that this place is the center of unity. This place we cannot afford to allow the capital city where the international community is to be where people would want to practice how to be violent. We will not allow that. We will allow violence that. No. Certainly not. I've seen all kind of uh, threats. Some will say, oh, you will die tomorrow, your children will die. I know I will die one day. So I don't need to tell me I will die. I know I will die. If it is tomorrow I die, it's not you that kill me. That's my time. So don't, so don't threaten me that I will die tomorrow. I will die the day God said I will uh, die. So guys, I'm sure you heard what uh, Minister Wike Nelson said that before Nigerian youths who have to go on any pro pro uh, protest, whether peaceful or anything, they have to pay for security costs. <laughs> See, the part that some people who were there were clapping for him, I was like, is these people normal? Are they normal? Eh? So... For us to fight for our own rights, we'll go and bargain with them. They will tell us price, that, and, and I'm sure they will say something they know that the youth might not be able to afford to pay. Where did they expect us to get the money to pay? Where they, where they, why, when they are the ones? Ah, God will see us through. You see, in this country, God is going to see us through. Anyway, guys, tell me what you think about that video on the comment section. And share this video, okay? Subscribe to my channel and follow my page depending where you're watching me from bye i love you guys